in this video i am going to discuss about a problem on rh criteria so the characteristic equation of a feedback control system is s power 4 plus 8 s cube plus 5 k s square plus 16 s plus 19 e is equals to 0 find the range of k for which the system is stable so here the characteristic equation of a feedback control system is given and we are asked to find the range of k for the system to be stable so first point is so writing the characteristic equation so given characteristic equation the characteristic equation is s power 4 plus 8 s cube plus 5 k s square plus 16 s plus 19 equal to 0 second step is constructing the routh array so first row is s power 4 row because the highest power is 4 so first row is s power 4 row elements of first row are coefficient of s power 4 coefficient of s square and coefficient of s power 0 so here the elements are 1 5k and 19 so now second row so second row is s cube row so s cube row elements are coefficient of s cube coefficient of s power 1 so that is 8 and 16 so you can cancel 8 and 16 on 8 table so the elements of s cube row becomes 1 and 2 now let us try to construct s square row elements so s square row elements are 5k into 1 minus 2 into 1 by 1 so that is the first element in s square row and second element is 19 into 1 minus 1 into 0 by 1 so it becomes 19 so s square row elements are 5k minus 2 and 19 now <coughs> let us try to find out the elements of s power 1 row so here we get only one element so that is 5k so towards right side uh, we are, uh, i am solving that so s power 1 row element 5k minus 2 into 2 minus 19 into 1 by 5k minus 2 so if we simplify that we get 10k minus 23 by 5k minus 2 so here we get only one element in s power 1 row and s power 0 row is 19 now coming to the third point now we have to investigate for the <coughs> stability of the system so for the system to be stable there should not be any sign change in the elements of first column the value of k should be chosen so that the first column elements are positive so that is the condition for the stability of the system so if we see the first row of the routh array 1 8 1 all these three are positive values so definitely for the system to be stable uh 5k minus 2 should be greater than 0 and 10k minus 23 by 5k minus 2 should be greater than 0 and uh, s not s power 0 value is 19 which is a positive value again so there should not be any sign change so already uh 1 so s power 4 row first element is 1 s cube row first element is 1 so they are positive values so the elements of uh, first element of s square should be positive and first element of s power 1 should be positive and first element of s power 0 is already positive value so for that so coming to the fourth point from s square row so from s square row s square row first element is 5k minus 2 that should be greater than 0 so from s square row for the system to be stable 5k minus 2 should be greater than 0 so k should be greater than 2 by 5 so which is k should be greater than 0.4 so we here we got 
one range of k. So that is k should be greater than 0.4. So for k greater than 0.4, so 5k minus 2 is positive. <coughs> now let us uh, uh, take the element of s power 1, first element of s power 1. So first element of s power 1 is 10k minus 23 by 5k minus 2. That should also be greater than 0. So from s power 1 row, for the system to be stable, 10k minus 23 by 5k minus 2 should be greater than 0. So 10k minus 23 should be greater than 0. So k should be greater than 23 by 10. So which is equals to k should be greater than 2.3. So by from s power 1 row, we are getting one more condition for k. So k should be greater than 2.3. So here we have two values for k. So from <coughs> the first element of uh, s square row, we are getting k should be greater than 0.4. And the first element, from the first element of s power 1 row, we are getting the k value, range of k as greater than 2.3. So here we have to take the highest value. So highest value is, so among 0.4 and 2.3, highest value is 2.3. So that's why, <coughs> therefore the range of k for the system to be stable is, k should be greater than 2.3. Because if we take any value in between, so 0.4 and 2.3, uh, s square first element of s square is positive but uh, first element of s power 1 is negative we get a negative value if we take any value in between 0.4 and 2.3 so that's why we should not take uh, k as greater than 0.4 take any value uh, greater than 2.3 so let's suppose uh, if we take 3 so which is greater than 2.4, uh, 2.3. Uh, so S square, first element of S square is, so if you take K as 3, so 15 minus 2 is 13. So second uh, S power 1 is also positive value. So if you take any value in between 0.4 and 2.3, uh, the first element of S square becomes a negative and the first element of S power 1 is positive. So that's why we have to take the highest value. So here k should be greater than 2.3. So for final uh, range of k for the system to be stable. So therefore the range of k for the system to be stable is k should be greater than 2.3.